Hello, my name is Hamann from Corinthia. Uh, today I would like to check out with you our uh, Defense One Top Sleeping Bag. As you see, uh, first uh, the compression or the size of the sleeping bag is uh, fairly small, I would say, compared to the Defense 4. The Defense 1 sleeping bag was actually made for warmer conditions, so the comfort limit temperature range is by plus 4 degrees. The differentiation between the uh, Defense One top that we see right here and the Tropen, there are a few ones. Uh, at one hand, the outer fabric we're using at Defense Four, uh, or the Defense Four is the same you find here in our Defense uh, One model. So that's one particular distinct, uh, uh, distinction. So, uh, for example, here we have a little bit of far more robust outer fabric, uh, polyamide outer fabric uh, with a rib stop that is water repellent. And of course, you find in our Defense One model the same cut and the same shape that is very significant to our defense range. We have one front zipper, one front decor zipper that is very easy to open up. The reason why we have those easy opening zippers are very simple. So by professional usage, if you want or if you have to move very quickly or if you have to change uh, the location, you want to exit very fast your sleeping bag. And, uh, uh, it's a differentiation, or it's a different approach to uh, see and find the side zipper to open it or just purely uh, be able to go on with, uh, with the uh, puller on the inside, just pull it and then go with your hands and open it up and then be able to change to move very, very quickly. On the inside, we'll also find the same polyamide inner fabric uh, filled with our uh, premium insulation G-Loft. Here we have an amount of G-Loft that keeps you warm by up to plus 4 degrees. Um, again, you will find on the inside very uh, a good uh, stitching. So you see here that we have stitched every single chamber, let's say, but in order to prevent any cold gaps or cold spots, you will find the final and the outer fabric laying loose on top of it. Uh, one uh, have to mention that of course zippers are always to a certain extent a cold gap as well. Here we are going to prevent uh, cooling out on those areas with an extra f uh, insulated flap that you see perfectly on top right over here. So this flap covers uh, the, the uh, frontal zipper in a perfect manner. Also you have two zippers that you can see very clearly and perfectly right here. So you have one zipper that you can open from the foot part, from the bottom part, and of course one going all the way up. And this just gives you the possibility to adjust, also maybe to ventilate, to have a certain air circulation. Uh, if you are a little bit too hot or if you are feeling too hot, you can open the zippers, particularly on the bottom part, just to keep uh, the air flowing. Again, um, uh, it's very important to mention that you find the, the uh, care instructions right on the outer flap. And the particular shape is the same uh, at the Defense 1 like Defense 4. So you have also the chance to uh, adjust the cordals on the left and on the right, just to even more compress uh, the, the head area in order to uh, prevent cooling out and uh, to make sure that only the, no the nose and the mouth area uh, look outside of the sleeping bag. The uh, broad shoulder width uh, allows you to also store 
you know, with some apparel or some uh, backpacks inside of the sleeping bag or to just uh, put it at the end of the sleeping bag as well. So in order that your uh, gear and that your equipment stays warm uh, and dry when you are staying overnight, for example. Um, the, uh, the defense uh, one top uh, is a sleeping bag that I would recommend you to use in uh, warmer conditions. Uh, but if you want to have the same uh, reliability like uh, at our, that you have seen and maybe witnessed in our Defense 4, but only for warmer conditions, then a Defense 1 is definitely the, uh, the choice you should uh, go for. Uh, finally, you will also find uh, two single uh, loops at the end of the sleeping bag at the foot box, and that actually enables you just to uh, let you hang the sleeping bag on some objects when you are in the forest you can hang it up uh, on a tree and uh, if by opening also the zippers it enables you for example a very quick uh, drying process so that the product is going to dry up very very fast and uh, yeah so that's something that is also very important some small details that makes the product uh, perfect and if you want to check out the product just uh, press the link down in the description